Action! Okay, today we're going to be making lemon squares. So as opposed to doing like a shortbread uh, bottom, we are going to do a graham cracker crust and then we're going to have a lemon curd on top. So in front of you, we have just the ingredients to make the graham cracker crust. So in front of you, we have graham crackers, we have butter, salt, and sugar. In a larger stainless steel bowl, I'm going to add my graham cracker crumbs. I'm going to add my sugar and then I'm going to add my salt. I'm going to give a little bit of mix with a plastic spatula and then I'm going to add my melted butter. So I melted my butter just using a microwave. So I'm going to pour that in there. Give it a mix. Once this is evenly mixed, we're going to pour it into our 8x8 frame, lined with parchment paper. Just going to spread it out as even as possible. And then we're going to pat it down with the bottom of the ramekin. We're going to bake this off at 325 for roughly 15 minutes. To make the filling, I have lemons, sugar, 35% cream, eggs, and salt. I'm just going to zest these lemons from top to bottom. Just gonna cut and juice the lemon now. Okay, it is now time for the filling. So for the filling, we're gonna have our lemon juice in a stainless steel bowl over a double boiler. Gonna add salt. Going to add my lemon zest. my sugar, my cream, and then also my eggs. So over the double boiler we're going to turn on our stove. We're going to cook this really really low until it reaches roughly 62 degrees Celsius. So make sure you continuously stir while we're heating up the lemon curd over the double boiler because you don't want scrambled eggs. So I have a thermometer in front of me. I'm slowly going to get up to 60 degrees. Uh, we just have to be in the range only because we're going to bake it in the oven afterwards as well. So we're at 50 something and we're going to slowly bring it up to 60. Next, we are going to strain our curd. Let's give it a swirl so everything comes up. With our curd strain, we're just going to pour it on top of our graham crust and we're going to bake this at 300 degrees. So we took the lemon bars out of the oven. So depending on the oven, it's going to take maybe a shorter or longer time. We actually had a thermometer and then we uh, took it out when the lemon curd reached 185 degrees Fahrenheit. And then we're just going to wait for it to cool and then we're going to slice it. At this point, once it's cooled and sliced, you can add a meringue on top and then torch the meringue. Uh, we're just going to have it like this as is.